Hello everybody, hope you're all doing okay. Uh, my name's Jean, if this is the first time you've been and watched a video on my channel. It is mostly unboxings that I do and that's actually what I've got today. Now, um, the one that I am going to show you is, um, I, did, I, I have actually opened it, but that's because I started doing the video for it and then kind of got sidetracked. So this is me starting it again but with uh, an open box I've just not got everything out uh, now I've had the box for the past few days it's it's the May sorry the June edition of the uh, scroller box um, and the reason that I've not opened it and done this video sooner is because I was still trying to rack my brains about May's challenge um, the flowing figures challenge now the the peerless watercolor uh, papers are not something that i'd used before i've watched quite a lot of um, youtube videos just trying to i don't know get ideas get inspiration and my brain's still kind of going yeah but I am going to keep trying to come up with uh, some sort of idea because the one that I kind of started sketching out, A, it's teeny really, and because it's so small, I wouldn't really be able to do that much detail on it, I don't think. And, and B, I think I just kind of want to do it again, or at least a bigger version of this particular one. Um, like I say, I started working on something. Uh, this is just a little tiny sketch, and it's just—I don't know. I don't—I don't know why my brain's procrastinating like this. But that is um, what I've got up to now um, for the flowing figures theme. So the June box. Here it is. Uh, I'll just go through the contents of it and then we'll have a look at what's in the magazine. Right, so we've got the June 22 uh, Scrawler Challenge, which is Electric Dreams. And it says, Sweet dreams are made of this. We're going bright, bold and loud this month with vibrant palette. Don't be restricted by realism. Take another look from a different perspective and break free from the tra traditional rules of colour to watch your dreamlike creations illuminate with a dynamic pop of neon. And the first item that we've got are four Pilot Pintor markers, neon red, yellow, green and apricot. And this is them. So yes, really quite bright and the sort with a, a mixing ball inside. And it says, uh, explore your wildest colourful dreams with these bold and vibrant paint markers. These wonderfully vivid markers feature a short hexagonal barrel, which makes them easy to grip and hold for extended use, which is really handy um, for someone who um, the hand cramps up after a, any length of time. And, and I know when I'm doing things with, with smaller things, uh, my hands do have a tendency to, to cramp up after a while. Um, the water-based pigment ink is ultra resistant and opaque and it will dry quickly, ensuring you won't smudge any of your creative designs. The ink will also dry permanent, so once dry you can layer colours to your heart's content. The markers are equipped with super strong nibs that won't disintegrate under pressure making them ideal for use in all kinds of rough surfaces. And these versatile pens are not limited to just paper. They can be used on a variety of different surfaces, including wood, paper, cardboard, fabrics, plastic, plastic, sorry, glass, metal, and more. These brilliant and expressive markers will be the perfect tool to start your neon colored journey. And these, the retail price of these each is three pound sixty nine p. So three six nine twelve. You've got just over fourteen quid's worth of supplies just on those four markers. Next that we have is a Pigma Micron zero five in purple. 
and that's this little fella here. Uh, this handy little Pigma Micron pen is a wonderful tool for precision and accuracy, perfect for outlining and detailing in your artwork. It features an acid-free ink that is derived from a single pigment to ensure colour consistency and reliability. The ink is also fade proof against sunlight or UV and is permanent when dry, giving all of your creations guaranteed a lasting quality. And, sorry, print on this is a bit faint. Right, the recommended retail price of this pen by itself is £3.15. So we're, we've got a, you know, a nice amount of stuff already. Right, uh, we have a, a pad underneath here, and it's a, a Frisk Bristol board, uh, A5 size, with 10 sheets. Uh, this Frisk Bristol board paper provides an acid-free, extra smooth and clean white surface, ideal for all of your illustrative needs with pencils, ink pens, technical pens and more. Both sides of each sheet of paper features an identical surface, so you can use either side for your creative designs. With 10 sheets, you should have plenty for all your swatching and creative needs. And the recommended retail price of this pad is 2 99 And this is what it looks like. It's uh, made especially for scroll box. That's what the paper looks like and it is very 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 smooth it's um it feels nice and flat it's it's like stroking a, a nice feeling smooth um surface as opposed to something like watercolor paper which has got that sort of slightly bobbly feel to it um to help absorb the water right let's get onto the magazine eh This month's sticker. We have an artist print, which is this one, nice and brightly coloured. Uh, a featured artist, Renata Payton. Renata Payton, aka Grem Wren, is an independent artist based in Melbourne, Australia. Best known for her work with acrylic paint pens, Renata primarily focuses on creating pieces with vibrant colour palettes and juxta juxtaposing them with natural subject matter to creative to, to creative fun I think that's a bit of a, a typo and colourful view of the world she spends her days creating joyful designs showing them on social media and sending her work all across the globe whether she's working paper, wood, fabric or paint swatches her distinctive use of colour always visually ties her designs together uh, and we've got some some links for her we've got an Etsy shop she's got an Instagram and a Twitter page so I will try to remember to put those details in on the info block downstairs so that if anybody watching this wants to have a look at her other work it'll be there when you click on the links okay Right, this month's sweetie is a Swizzles Stinger and it says that they're the cheekiest chew bars on the planet, a delicious tutti frutti flavour chew bar with a fizzy centre. And um, the Swizzles bars usually are really nice. Um, there's a, I can't remember what the heck they're called, they might be called fizzes, I can't remember. Uh, there's some that they do. Um, that have got sherbet through the middle refreshers that's it refresher bars uh, and they got um like a, a strip of um yeah sherbet through the middle so yeah very nice okay so my phone is telling me that the space that i've got left is very low uh so very quickly we've got a q a with the scroller artist we've got some scroller tips and things to try and we have some artists advice. Uh, we've got the scroller gallery from the April 2022 scroller box and some artwork from that. 
and then we've got scroll that extra all things neon and behind the artwork so that's it for this month while it is still june um scroll box um i hope you've enjoyed watching this video you know drop me a comment or whatever down below and i will try to reply in a timely manner but i'm gonna go now before my phone runs out of space see you all again soon guys bye bye